Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be reviewing Tecolote Canyon Executive Golf Course. Here's a quick look at the map real quick. Starting here at the clubhouse, you're going to go around the course all the way in a circle, coming back to the clubhouse on 18. Practice areas here were not my favorite. I give them a 2 out of 5. And the first tee box is just around the corner. This is the carts. The carts were average. Um, three out of five stars, in my opinion. Uh, had what they needed, but nothing extra. This is actually my second shot. I forgot to film the first one. Like I said, the tee box is just up there. Around that corner from the putting green. This is going to be my third shot for par. The greens weren't the best. Um, and started off with a bogey. Second hole of the day, you can see the tee boxes are not bad. The fairways are a little rough over here, but great first shot. Put that just short of the green, which conditions up there are actually pretty nice. But then on the green again, and not the best conditions. little par putt right there all right showing off a little bit of the scenery as you can see it's pretty tight in here there is, all the fairways are kind of skinny like this they're gonna be tough to hit with a driver for sure so you're gonna have a lot of iron shots a lot of pitching wedge shots I used my pitching wedge like 80% of today uh, I was kind of aiming a little farther to the bank but left it way short and I have this putt for par, I'm pretty sure. And I don't know where I was aiming. Not horrible though. And like I said, not the best greens. Here in the next hole, hit it a little bit fat. Tee boxes are still pretty good so far. Fairways are getting a little better. Chipped it a little short. And greens are still mediocre. All right, everyone close your eyes for this next part because no one wants to see this. I'm gonna take this time to rate the fairways and the greens. I'd give the fairways a three out of five and the greens probably a three out of five as well. They're both very average, not the best. Kind of like my putting skills. All right, moving on to the next hole, hole number five. This is actually the first par four of the day. Every other hole before this was a par three. And for this hole, it was 305 yards. Getting it up there in three. Like I said, greens were not the best, so left it short again. And a nice little bogey. Alright, for the overall score for Tecolote, I would say it's probably a 2.5 out of 5. Again, this is my overall rating because I'm more of a fan of par 72 courses, but if you're trying to get a quick round in after work, or maybe you're just trying to get um, your friends that don't play golf as often on a course, this might be the place. The only thing I would say is bring a lot of balls because it's very skinny and you're going to lose a lot 